Republican Congressman Dana Rohrabacher, one of the U.S. House's leading proponents of weed reform, says he uses medical cannabis to treat arthritis. The California representative made the admission on Capitol Hill Tuesday while meeting with members of pro-legalization group Normal. I haven't been able to go surfing for a year and a half and I've been in severe pain because I spent all this time doing that, which I can barely do now, and it wore all the cartilage out here, you know? So let's say about 30 years of really good surfing and now I'm in pain because I've got arthritis. It was worth it. I'll tell you, I'd do it again, okay? <laughs> Especially if there's something we can do about it. And I went to one of these hemp fests or something like that. They had San Bernardino and this guy is showing me the medical things and all that. And he says, and you should try this. And it's a candle and you light the candle and it waxes in there, it melts down. Then you rub it on you, whatever you've got problems with. And you know what? I tried it about two weeks ago and it's the first time in a year and a half that I had a decent night's sleep because the arthritis pain was gone. And uh, now... Now don't tell anybody I broke the law. <laughs> Actually, you know, bust, they'll bust down my door. The bottom line is that there's definitely cannabis in there and it makes sure that I can sleep now. This marks the first time that Rohrabacher or any other recent member of U.S. Congress has admitted to using cannabis while in office. According to Tom Engel, founder of Marijuana Majority, it's beneficial when cannabis consumers, especially elected officials, publicly admit to using the plant. Quote, putting a face on the people who use marijuana will help immensely in the battle to end criminalization and other forms of harmful discrimination. It's now going to be much harder for members of Congress, particularly those in the GOP caucus, to vote against medical marijuana, since they now know that one of their friends and colleagues is directly benefiting from it, he said.